Well, easily one of the most talked about shows of the season. And just like that, not only brought our favorite sex in the city back to the Big Apple, but also added some new faces into the mix. That includes Carrie's podcast producer, Franklin, who fans already can't get enough of. Take a look. You're so good when people call in about that relationship stuff. Oh. I think you're a podcast. How dare you? <laughs> I'm serious. I've been watching you since you got there. I've seen you open up, come into your own. Plus, you have that voice. I'd like to produce you alone, talking to callers. How much champagne have you had? <laughs> None. Come on. Give me a shot. Uh, and Ivan is with me now. Hi, good to see Hi, you. Hi, Sarah. Nice to meet you. <laughs> How could she say no to that? Uh, well, <laughs> she didn't. She had to do it. So, I know. So, you know. I mean, you've got two hot projects right now, mm -hmm. obviously, uh, in Just Like That and uh, with uh, Dear Evan Hansen. Right. But you're also in Vogue. You're in Glamour. You're in The Post. Like, what does this moment feel yeah, like for you right a, now? Yeah, it's been a couple of crazy weeks, but fun and exciting and, and great to see how excited the fans are, uh, you know, and how surprised they were at the ending. So, yeah. Uh, it's been a lot of fun. I'm sure it's been a lot of fun. Talk mm -hmm. to us about and just like that. I mean, this Sex and the City. Everyone knows Sex and the City. It's yeah. such a huge show. Did right. you watch? I did, of course. I was a huge fan oh, of the original were. series. Yeah. So when I when I got the job, I was super excited. And uh, were you nervous at all, though? Like hesitations? Like I don't know. Like this is a well. You're always a little nervous. You want to make you want to do it right and um, and and make sure that um, that you know that the fans are <laughs> happy about it. But uh, yeah. um, but also. But just super excited to do it. So. Yeah, and he got a job to do, so well, you're going to do exactly, it. Exactly, yeah. Um, so a little spoiler here, but it's been out, so I'm sure most people know. Right. I mean, we got to talk about the elevator kiss that's, with SJP. That's the big talk, yeah. That's the big talk. So I want to know, like, how long you had to keep that under wraps, oh. and are you good at keeping secrets? I, yeah. Well, the thing. Uh, well, for one thing, I didn't know what was going to happen until I got the last episode, episode 10. So it was a surprise so you were to me. We were already filming. Yeah, we were already filming. We yeah. shot the first few episodes, and then I got the last episode, and. Uh, and I, I was like, oh, oh my God, myself. <laughs> I, I had no idea exactly what was I knew Michael Patrick King was like, there's going to be a big ending. It's yeah. going to be fun and exciting. But, but I didn't you know. did call your wife, though, right? Of course, say, after okay, I found okay, out. Okay. I told, I, of course, yeah, I told her. And then <laughs> we shot it a couple of months before it came out. So then I had to, I know, I told my wife and maybe a couple of friends, and that was that it. Was it. That's yeah. It. So I mean, what do you think makes Franklin the right fit for her right now, though? Well, I mean, he seems like a nice guy. Yes, right? he does. He does. <laughs> Is there a twist? Uh, I, we don't else? know. We, I, ha I know as much as everybody else. Yeah. Know? We don't know what's gonna happen. I mean, um, if the producers, if Michael Patrick King and HBO want to see where this story leads, that that would be great. I've had, I've had a great time playing the characters. So, yeah. If, but, if we do get a season two, what would you like to see for the two of them? Um, well, I mean, I have my own ideas, but it's it's totally not up to me. So I, I'm just as curious to see what happens as anyone else. Yeah. Well, in addition to all that fun, mm -hmm. uh, you're also on stage on Broadway in Dear right. Evan Hansen, which you joined in 2019. I was lucky enough to see you oh, a couple yeah. of weeks ago. Oh, you're so great in the oh, show. Thank you. But what's it like just being back on stage, returning to this show after you, you joined in 2019, then you had to leave seven yeah. months later, right? I know. Well, we got shut down yeah. because of the pandemic, and it was a, 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 you know, a horrible ending and this traumatic, like, just don't come back, and then we were gone for so long. And right. so I, I definitely felt like I, I wanted to come back and reopen Broadway and uh, be on stage again with this wonderful cast uh, with Jordan Fisher. And uh, it's been really wonderful to be back and to see audiences again coming to Broadway uh, shows. Uh, it's, it's, it's been great. Well, and it could be a pretty emotional play, and you play yeah. it night after night, and you play Connor's dad, and you're a dad yourself. Does, yeah. it, does some of those emotions kind of overlap a little yeah, bit? Yeah, it's intense. I mean, it's a, it's a powerful piece, and um, and there's a lot of emotions going on. But I, but I, I tell myself that, you know, every night there's probably somebody there who hasn't seen the show before, yeah. and so you want to give the performance every night like you've never done it before. And, yeah. Uh, uh, and I think it's a beautiful show, so I'm glad to be there doing it. Yeah, and there's a lot of people, a lot of theater people, that are also involved in and just like that. Have yeah. there been any musical moments on set? Yeah, of course. Sara Ramirez, who, who yeah. played the podcast uh, host, host, and uh, even SJ, you know, Sarah Jessica Parker, she had done theater before. 
Lawrence yes, Silver right, Theater. Yes, she was Annie. So yeah, I think there were some show tunes that we were singing. They would just sing between takes, and I would—I was a little shy about singing, but I would watch them. Yeah, yeah. Well, it was nice to see you on that. It's nice to see you on it just like that. I hope you get a season two so we can see what happens between you and Carrie's character. <laughs> Thank you. And just like that is streaming now on HBO Max, and you can see Ivan and Dear Evan Hansen playing now at the Music Box Theater. Thank you so much for stopping Thank in. Thank you so much for having me.